Hello everyone. Today I got one question from trigonometry, and I'm gonna prove it. Most of the students, I found that most of the students take RHS here, but I prefer you to take the LHS because it is more easier from the LHS to prove it. If it is given sine to the power four x, it can be written as sine e square whole e square because sine e square power to the power is multiplied so sine to the power 4 it will get the sine to the power of 4 and just multiply here by 2 and if we multiply here by 2 then the this square make it 4 so that to cancel the 4 divide it by 4 now you can write 2 sine e square theta 2 sine e square theta other 2 sine e square x means 1 minus cos to theta cos 2x 2 cos square x means 1 minus apply formula here 1 minus cos 2x whole square upon 4 okay then in next step 1 minus cos 2x is the apply here again formula a minus b whole square then it can be written as a square minus 2ab plus b square cos square 2x upon 4 here again multiply the numerator and denominator by 2 then if you multiply numerator by 2 then 1 will be 2 and 2 will be 4 cos 2x and this will be 2 cos square 2x upon and denominator also gets sense here if you multiply it by 2 to the numerator and denominator and 4 will be 8 here now 2 write it as it is cos 2x plus 2 cos square x if we suppose 2x as theta and 2 cos square theta means 1 plus cos to theta apply the same formula here again 2 cos square theta means 1 plus cos 2 theta 2 theta means 2 theta into 2x into 2x and 2x into 2x is 4x so that we get here 4x upon 8 this implies equals to and 2 plus 1 is 3 minus 4 cos 2x up plus cos 4x and if we bring it it like this one by by taking common here you can write it in this form also 1 by 8 times 3 minus 4 plus 2x upon and this is all we have to need root